गुड मॉर्निंग क्लास सिक्स स्टूडेंट्स आई होप यू ऑल आर फाइन एंड सेफ एट योर होम्स टुडे वी विल कंटिन्यू विद अ पोएम एज आई वेंचर फ्रॉम स्टैंड फोर सो लेट स्टार्ट एज आई वेंचर टू द वुड अ डेजलिंग फ्लॉ वेव्ड हर फेस इन ब्लेजिंग शो ऑफ डांस इन चेज एंड रेड इन ब्राइट इन शेड ऑफ डॉन शी फ्लर्टेड लाइक अ प्रांसिंग फोन so students in the fourth stanza poet describes describes how the dewy and pleasant air makes the beautiful flower dance in merry he also tells us that how the early morning sun rays makes the flower look very bright and beautiful and how it dances merrily like a baby deer fawn means baby deer fifth stanza As I ventured to the wood a butterfly had graced my arm and knowing I bid him no harm he played for me hypnotic wing in colors for the urge me sing so in the fifth stanza poet describes the welcoming gesture of a butterfly how it settles on the poet's arm when she realizes the comfort in his arm and he also didn't hurt her and urges him to sing and how the poet gets attracted seeing beautiful wings of the butterfly six tens are as i ventured to the wood the radiant sun shone down on me he flushed and beam i say to thee you bless our land be filled with pride and cherish ever your country side So in the six tens, a student, uh, the brightly glowing sun shines down upon the poet. And the sun invites the poet to appreciate and enjoy the countryside and be proud of it. So that's a student in this poem. So poet of this poem is Mark Raymond Slaughter. You have to remember this. Uh, let's do the recap. In the first tens, a poet tells how he undertakes the daring journey to the woods and how the dewy air settles on his hair and how he feels then the comfort the coziness is being described by him here in the second stanza he tells of about the welcoming gesture of cuckoo and dove and how they sing and welcomes him in the third stanza he talks about a deer who invites him to the jungle and he feels very lucky when the deer looks at him he also talk about bodo uh, that the heavenly aura the uh, bright and glowing appearance of deer how it makes him feel like fine bodo fine wine of france then uh, in fifth stanza we talk about how flower beautiful flower welcomes the poet to the jungle and the dance and merry of the fla then in fifth stanza how butterfly welcomes the poet to the jungle she she sits on his arm and he gets attracted towards her wings in the last stanza the sun itself is welcoming the poet to the jungle and asking to appreciate the beauty of the countryside and how beautiful the countryside looks like he wants the poet to appreciate the beauty so students uh, words to know there are some word meanings which you have to learn shimmer to shine tranquil head calm state of mind cooing a bird's call fellow pale limpid eye calm carefree 
appearance heavenly aura bright and glowing appearance bordeaux a place in france known for its fine wine prancing dancing gaily hypnotic having the power of attracting others spread spread wide yawn old english word meaning yonder or there so students now this is homework time page number 29 part a reading skills as the speaker ventured into the wood he was welcomed in different ways match the two columns to know how nature welcome him so you have to match put the columns and column a you have, you can see six parts are there you have to match them with column b let's read dewy air cuckoo and dove limpid eyed deer bright red flower butterfly the sun so you have to match them with column b how they invited the poet to the jungle so first column b first part is glanced at him and charmed him with his heavenly appearance so you all know who charmed the poet with heavenly appearance so you have to match a with sorry first part with c limpid eyed deer second is settled on his arm and urge him to sing third little drops of dew got entangled in his hair and glistened fourth invited him to appreciate and enjoy the countryside and be proud of it fifth burst into a welcome song sixth tossed to and fro like a floating fawn so students you have to match all these after reading the poem and understanding it so we will meet in the next class take care of yourself